Hey guys, Krista Jones here from Davy and Krista. And in this video, I'm going to teach you how to update your show it color palette. So within any design, you're going to find colors already set in the design settings. So these are the ones that come with our Cape Town design. If I wanted to update my colors to say this color palette, for example, all I need to do is put in the hex codes. So I like to update my color palettes by going with colors that are similar to the ones that already exist in the site. Um, so let's say, for example, instead of this dark gray, like black color, I wanted to have this black color. I'm going to copy this hex code and then I'm going to paste it in here. Next, I'm going to look for like my brighter colors or colors that are used kind of as accents throughout the site. So in this particular design, that's going to be this pink color and this gold color. And I'm going to update that with another color that is going to be used similarly. So maybe I want to use this blue instead of the pink. So I'll come in here and put the blue in there. And then maybe instead of that gold, I want to use this unusual gray. So I'll copy that one and then I'll put this one in here. I want to keep kind of the same tones similar between the different colors. So I'll use this Cornwall color in here because that's kind of our next darkest color. And then I'll update this gray pebble with this one and I'll hit that one. And then I'm going to do this Carrera as one of my off whites. So I'll use this one here. And if I had more colors, I could also do another similar color here in number seven. Um, and I could even replace the white color if I wanted to. Just keep in mind that if you replace this eight, if you look in here, you can see that eight is set as the background as for the default pages and default canvases. Um, so if you change that to a color, it's gonna change everything by default. So maybe you want your website to be like an off-white color. If that's the case, I would put a different color in eight and then that'll update it throughout the site. So I'm gonna hit save. And then I can see that like this area is not a harsh black anymore. My fonts have changed too. They're not the darker black, they're a lighter black. Um, and if you just kind of scroll through the site, you'll see that some of the colors updated it. It may not update every single color on your site, but it should help get you closer to customizing your site to work with your brand. And if you have any questions about updating color palettes, feel free to drop them in the comments below. Thanks guys.